Hello, Anna. It is Thursday, and I just failed a final. Okay, I probably didn't fail it, but I didn't do particularly well either. It was kind of disappointing. Um, I apologize for the echo. Uh, we are in the process of moving out for the semester, and Christina just left, and there's pretty much nothing in the room right now. Um, so it echoes, which is really unsettling, and I don't like it. Uh, I have a punishment to do for you, and this may not suffice, and if you don't think it's sufficient, just let me know, and I'll redo it when I'm home and have access to my vast library of comic books, but for now, the only comic book I have with me is Sandman, Volume 9, The Kindly Ones. Um, so I thought I'd just read you a couple bits from it. They're not action-y, and they're really aren't any sound effects, but um, they're funny, so I thought you might like them. Basically, what's happening on this page that I've bookmarked that I'm going to read for you um, is Dream, who is the main character of the Sandman graphic novels, is talking to his sister, Delirium, and as her name implies, she's a little bit... Um, and she is looking for her dog and she figured she'd come ask Dream because he is helpful. Um, let's see, so what did I want to... What did I want to read to you? It's really funny but it might not make sense to you. I'm going to give them British accents because Neil Gaiman is British and he wrote this and I always just feel that the Endless should have British accents. So. This, um, I'll do sort of a raspy voice for Dream and a more girly voice for Delirium, since Dream's a guy and Delirium's a girl. Right, I'm doing this properly. I'm in my place where the thingies are, and I'm talking to the one with your siggy thing on it, and I'm talking to it properly. Can I come and see you now? If you must. I really must. Um, hi. I'm looking for my doggy. Do you remember my doggy? I got him on the day that I ate all the cherries up. From our brother. I have not forgotten. Well, I spoke to our brother, and he said, There's a statue of you that looks all sadly in the garden. You saw him? Destruction said that? Said what? That there was a statue of me that looked all sadly. He never said that. I said that. Indeed, but you saw destruction. Destiny, not destruction. I saw destiny. He said you'd know about Barnabas. He said it couldn't hurt to come and see you. He told me not to come and see you, too. He said it both. Will you help me find my doggy? You and me, we had such a nice time the last time we went looking for someone. Did we? Didn't we? So, can you come with me and look? Um, that's probably the best you're going to get from that page. I just think she's funny. And now Delirium is talking to a fairy, also about looking for her doggy. So I'll give the fairy a more proper British accent. Hello. Hello. We're looking for my doggy. That's nice. So far we've found lots of clues. Here's a little swan made of ice, and a toffee, and a tongue stud, and a word that means red and green at the same time. Oh, this is Borkhal Runtapal. Borkhal Runtapal, this is a lady I don't know either. My name is Nuala, and it pleases you. Charmed. My lady delirium, what do you know about your brother, the Lord Shaper? Ah, uh, stuff, things, oddments? And then she's talking about looking for her doggy. You haven't seen my doggy anywhere. He's, he's black and brown at the same time. He's a nice sort of doggy, except when he's grumpy. No, but, um, well, where did you leave him? That is so extremely clever. I never thought of that. Thank you, pretty fairy. I think you must be my good fairy. I wish I could give you a present. Do you need a word that means red and green at the same time? People can probably hear me in the hallway, and they're probably like... What is she doing? You know, I don't know why I'm bothering to make you a video right now, because I had to pack my Ethernet cable away, and I'm pretty sure I won't even be able to upload this. <sighs> sort of fizzled out from possibly failing a final, and I am tired, 
and I don't have a pillow or a blanket to sleep on right now. I have a bottom sheet on my bed, and that is all. And tonight, I shall be sleeping with my duffel bag as my pillow and my jacket as a blanket. Yes, I am a hobo. I am the dorm room hobo of Ithaca College. Um, I hope things are going well for you. Hope you're enjoying your time at home and playing Assassin's Creed. Oh yeah, DFTBA, Nerd Fighters. <laughs> Getting internet without an ethernet cable. Step one, turn on wireless networks. Step two, pray.